Carla Buderak and welcome to Behavior Communicates. Today's episode is on organizational health. Do you have a student in your life who has trouble getting to class on time with all the right materials? They forget their textbooks, their calculators, their journals, their homework? Well, I have five ideas for you that can help with that. The first one is a schematic or a map of the school. You get these on back to school nights, so take advantage of them and color code where your child needs to go and coordinate that with the subject matter. That way they can see where they're going, what materials they need to go to math class, to science class, to English class, and they can even see when they have time to stop at their locker and switch books. They can carry one with them and they can set one up as a visual reminder in their school locker. The second idea I have for you is to actually color code their textbooks. You can use construction paper or stretchy fabric over the textbooks and the notebooks, but they're color coded so the student can see quickly that they go together and they can grab them when they need to go to class. The third idea I have for you is a, a homework folder where it's labeled and there's a to-do side and a done side. So many of our students have trouble remembering homework in the first place and then if they do it, somehow it has trouble getting back to school. So if you've got a folder for all the homework or color-coded along with the classes, it's more likely to get back to school. The fourth idea I have for you is an end of the day checklist because sometimes our students have trouble getting things from school to home. So if he or she has a checklist in their locker, they can go right down and see what homework they have, what permission slips they need, what supply list they need, and check it right off. So there's a nice visual reminder in their locker. And the last thing that I have for you is yellow pages, personal yellow pages for your child. Names of their counselor, their homeroom, their uh, power school, website, the homework hotline, anything like that can go right in their locker for a quick visual reminder. So I've given you five ideas to help your student with organizational skills. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends on Facebook and Twitter and all your other social media. And thank you again for joining me here at Behavior Communicates where I help you create a life for your child or your student where you both get what you really want and what you really need. Thanks again, and I'll see you next time.